these little things are what makes you unique and will help you create your own sound. What's going on is Casey from casey-sounds.com. So today's video is how to find your sound as a producer. So I've got a question on Instagram DM asking how, how can they become a better producer? How can they find their sound? So my answer to this question is my process from when I started out as a producer and what's helped me to get to this point. So I'm going to share with you a couple of tips so you can start implementing that and find your own sound. So first tip is to listen to loads of music. This is what I've done. First thing I've done was listen to beats and songs that I liked and try to recreate that beat or that song. Drop the song into your session and try recreate that beat using the same sounds, using the same structure. And this way, it will help you to understand little pieces, bits and pieces that goes into a beat or into the, yeah, into the beat, into the instrumentation. And just gets, gives you a better understanding of what sounds to choose for that beat, for the genre, for the genre, 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 genre. Can't even remember how to say it. <laughs> um, yeah, so, so this, that will help you with sound selection and understanding of structure and how to put beats together. Another thing you can do is remixes. This is what I've done that helped me loads is just get acapellas or I'd enter competitions for uh, remixes remix competitions I can't even remember what the what it was called come second place with a dubstep remix uh, for Kate Kate I can't even remember the name I'm gonna find it and put the description in the in, uh, put the link in the description below why am I talking so close to the camera but yeah so remixing help me just putting out music because then sometimes you're just putting out beats people don't really when you're just putting out beats as a beginner people might not really feel what you're there but if they hear vocals in it and it's something that they recognize from before then you might get a bit more love from that um but at the same time this is just building you as a producer so it's not really a case of how much love you're getting for what you're doing at this at that point do you know what i'm saying this is just understanding how to find and create your sound um, so yeah, doing remix will definitely help you and this will help to develop your, your style. So one of the one of the key things, which, which is the third thing I'm going to get onto, which will help you find your sound is when you're recreating a beat or you're making a beat or you're listening, when you're making beats, you're going to have a certain flavor to your beat. So if you're going to try and recreate someone's beat, you're, you might add your hi-hats in it in a different way you might swing things a different way you might add your snare a little bit later than the one that you're trying to cre recreate and you're going to have certain ways of doing things like tim says you're going to have a certain bounce which is unique to you like oh, i forget what the quote is but tim says if we were all given the same pack of drums we're going to create different beats which is true definitely true so you might have a certain way of putting your hi-hats together you might do triplets um you might do crazy runs or you might have your hit like i said your, your snares might hit a different way a little bit later or you might be like fully quantized to the grid but these little things are what makes you unique and help you create your own sound or create your create your sound just quickly going back remake beats listen to how they've put them together how it's structured what sounds they've used what drums they've used drum patterns Two, do remixes find acapellas online find competitions online get involved with that start doing remixes and that will help you to keep building and then the third the third thing to do is just listen to beats it's kind of like one but you, you don't listen to the beat but you're going to recreate it and just add your own style and flavor rather than just copy the beat you're going to do things a little bit different and this should help you to create your own sound so i hope this video has helped if it has hit that like button be sure to hit me up on instagram if you've got any questions and uh, hit that like button hit the subscribe button and the notification bell so you get notified anytime i put up a new video as per usual i appreciate your time thanks for watching